Alright, coming up next, a matchup in the UFC lightweight division between Alexander the Great Volkanovsky and Mark Jacasey. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe not. This is a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? Opens with the left hand and lands flush. He loaded up there on that high kick. Huge shots there! Edge of your seat action as expected so far. Well, he continues to stay busy, and he continues to land with volume punches here. I mean, volume, but he's not wasting anything. He's so accurate out there. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. And now he lands a combination. Oh, oh big left. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Some real power shots here. Misses with the straight left hand. Whoa! News hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Yeah, he's hurt really bad. And you hear the crowd react every time they come together because they understand the power that these guys are striking with. Oh, there's a takedown attempt. Unable to get that. Looks a little wobbly on his feet. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got a pressure. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Quick entry to get Man, him on a single. Was a great single. Oh. Nice big takedown. What a technique. What a takedown. Great high impact skill. You could feel the canvas reverberating here at the bottom. I mean, right there. That's a perfect scramble right there. Beautiful transition. He takes it for a ride. What a high impact takedown that was. First round winding down here. Big kick. Big power shot there. So the crowd voicing its appreciation after that round. We had a knockdown courtesy of a punch midway through. DC, here's your highlight. It was straight. He threw him in combination and landed that big punch that really did hurt his opponent. Lesser men would have been done. if he can advance position. Oh, back up. He's going to try to take him down. There you go. The shades of Cormier against Dan Henderson back in the day just slammed his opponent to the ground. I mean, just slammed him, lifted him up, and almost treated him like a baby. If you can pick a guy up off his feet, it's so discouraging for men that are used to being the alphas in all situations. Oh! oh shot finds the target there! Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow up with him. The kill shot. That's what they call it. Going into fight. Well, the strike lands there, but 
Doesn't do a ton of damage because the fighter's cooked. Yeah, he's done. He's oh, that was a big takedown. Is this the one that's going to break him? All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful. Hang on. <laughs> Transitions and scrambles on the ground. High level grappling can really be entertaining. Watch the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right, I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit taller. victory for that fighter here tonight. Well, let's take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched him. I mean, now we go inside. 